coming up. the view from our living room like we're just sitting on the couch you just look out and it's just so pretty out there it's a pretty little girl oops so we have a dogwood right there and then lots and lots of trees yellow. the grapes are turning yellow too yeah for the grapevines okay Probably looks better in person. They take videos and it just doesn't look that great. But just sitting here, you're just like, wow, all around me and ev out every window of our house is just beautiful. So there are the grapes. Should I go down and show them the grapes? Mm -hmm. Let me jump down. Whoa! It's gonna be crunchy when all the leaves that fell. Yep, the grapes are turning yellow. You all better play in your forts before after all the leaves fall off and it's not a fort much longer. Mm, thanks. And nice stuff on thanks. So this is the forts in here under all the grape vines. <gasps> One last grape, look. Ooh. This looks like a good one. Hmm. Want it? Mm, I don't like that type as much. Okay. I like the first ones that come out the best. Yes, the, the first ones are the best. So we have some pretty red trees down there. More yellow grapevines. More red trees back on that side. The figs have like lost all their leaves while we were at Lori's house. We got home last night. Oh, I see one fig left over there. I'm gonna get it. And that grape was good. Oh, there's a few more figs. We have not yet had our first freeze. So, um, that's nice. When it does freeze, we are going to make rose hips with that. I'm gonna go pick those figs. This fig is itty bitty, but it's still gonna be good. I'm gonna try it. And the grape was good too. I think there might be just a couple more figs left up there. I've had a long fig season. Several months of figs. This is down by the garden. Some pretty red trees down here. And the back side of the house. We've got the playground equipment here that Thomas is building. There's the monkey bars and his pull-up bar and the parallel bars. And I'm not sure what else he's building, but he's still working on it. And there's into the woods behind the trampoline. <laughs> And over towards the front of the house with the beautiful trees again. I like the contrast of the dark green, evergreen trees too. Like on this side, 
looking out the window and seeing the brightly colored trees and then the dark evergreen tree. It's pretty. Playing soccer? Yeah. Wanna go for a walk in the woods? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Samuel. Happy birthday to you. Go. We are carving pumpkins on this beautiful fall day. Got a giant clump of seeds. Yeah. Why do I have to touch all this stuff? <laughs> Look at my hands. Ooh. Slimy. Slimy. This is how much I've gotten so far. So good job. Okay. Big clump of seeds. We had up. to buy these, sadly. Big clump of seeds coming up. <laughs> Most years we've grown our own. But this year, only the small pumpkins worked. The little tiny pumpkins and the little cute gourds worked. Mm -hmm. Did I just buzz them on you? Yeah. I was wondering. <laughs> I was like, did, 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 did some just like get on me? Mm -hmm. I was wondering, like, ran on me. <laughs> Last year we just grew funny gourds that Sam and Andy <laughs> carved by themselves. I am. <laughs> And the year before that, we grew tons of small pumpkins that lined the whole front porch. There's so many. And then another guy gave us a lot of ginormous pumpkins. Oh yeah, we did get some ginormous pumpkins from a neighbor. A guy well, sort of close by. We call him the Gourd Man. That's where we got these gourds. And I saved the seeds and I grew them. Yeah. All right. Yeah, also, I had pumpkins that were this big. That's um, huge. Giant. Um, That's really yeah. huge. Mm -hmm. Kayla's probably the one that grew the biggest pumpkin. Remember the pump big pumpkin you grew with your name in it? Oh yeah. One of our biggest ones you've grown. Yeah. How big was it? Pretty big. Yeah, a little bit bigger than the one you're doing. This one. Mm -hmm. I know it got. It. This is the perfect day for me because my name is Autumn. Your name is Autumn. Hello, Autumn the chicken. That's what you're carving. You're having fun. Uh, I'm eating the seeds. I can help carve with my beak. Yeah, the excavator is the one that goes like, that goes like, mm. And the one that only, that has the big one. That's the big one. Yeah, I'm big. And then, um, yeah, and then the, the back hole, which has a small version, and then the front board version. While the kids are carving pumpkins, I came down to check for eggs. By the barn, I'm going to show you a few more trees. I know y'all are sick of the autumn trees, but don't worry. The leaves will all fall off and I'll not be showing them to you all winter. That's the big tree that fell down during the hurricane that went across the road right there. So it's all about cleaned up. Thanks to some really great friends. This was our pasture where we had Maisie, our cow, our sweet cow. I really miss her. I'm trying to take this opportunity to go, you know, we went on the trip to the east coast and then 
our camping trip. Well, we don't have a milk cow, but I'm ready for one now. She usually lived around here. And then she could go all the way up to Blueberry Hill. She had all that as a pasture to eat. But down here is where we milked her. And then she also has a pasture over there she could go to too. She was so sweet. Ha ha ha. Where are the ducks? Anyway, I guess that's all. So pretty. How's the pumpkin carving? Good, really good. I got, good? I got my lid off right now. <laughs> Yay. I got Any progress? Yep. Yay. I'm about that. Oh, oh. I almost my, all my uh, pumpkin carved out Yay. with just my hands. I was just Wow. It's so, it's so oh. high, not a gooey. It's so hard to get the gooey part. Are you working hard on it, though? You haven't quit. She got an easy pumpkin. Yeah. Or maybe she just has stronger fingers. Mm -hmm. I kind of twist the strands around my fingers and then so they don't slip as much and then grab them really hard. How are things going? Good. Good. Yeah, you got in the getting a the face there? Yeah. I think it's fun. I'm just about done holding up my pumpkin. Does anybody have a knife I can use? I'm sure you can use this one. I think so. It's snowing in Provo today in Utah. Oh, what? Oh, what? It's like hot out here. <laughs> yeah, we're sweating out here. Are you taking a video? Yeah. Oh. Yay! Well, I mean, well, that's why I moved out here. I don't like it to get so nice. that cold in October. Yeah, it's just once or twice before Halloween. So this is Andy's, and he's going to leave it like that and see if the chickens will peck through the rest of this mouth and eye right there. Yeah, he like just scraped off a bit, so to like encourage them to peck in the soft the um soft part right there and that's what i'm gonna do for my pumpkin too are you gonna do that that'll be yeah, cool I'm gonna do that too. Yeah, come back i'm gonna write my the back. back if they don't then i'll just finish carving it out mm. Mom, this is my sure Ooh, cool See, do you know the eyes when I said when I was crossed? Mommy, uh -huh. then yeah, this is the nose, then these are the teeth. Yeah. yeah. Mine is done by the garage where it will probably get more people to peck at it, which it has to get more. I'm scraping off the mouth for the chickens to peck at it, and all the little pieces are on the make little confetti. Uh -huh. Last time I checked a few minutes ago, it was like this much deeper. <laughs> <laughs> Happy tonight, stay surprised. Hmm, I don't know. Let's see your teeth, Tilly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she pulled out her other front tooth last week when I was in Asheville doing cleanup. Well, okay, mm -hmm. That's really one of the nice very few inside. teeth I've missed oh, yeah. kids pulling out. Um, yeah, so it was in the morning. I was I was um, wiggling it and then I got some blood and stuff so then I wiggled it more and then Sarah and then oh, Sarah, and then a few minutes later we went upstairs oh, yeah. and Maddie was in the shower and, and we would take turns wiggling it and Sam got it out. Sam pulled it out? Yeah. Oh, I didn't even hear that. Wow. Yeah, and then and then we went over right and then we went downstairs and, and waited for Maddie to get out and when she went out then I started thinking now I want to kiss her says we too Really? I bet she likes that. I took a video on the iPad which will you can see here. Okay, I would like to see it.
Oh, well, that's fun. His tooth fell out. Your pumpkin's tooth fell out. Yeah, uh, mommy. Well, oh no. Well, that happens mommy, to me sometimes. Yeah, mommy, I ate this at sunset. This is like my first time having it. Then I was gonna do one like to, like this. Mm -hmm. like, this, except for I, except for my teeth, except for my these two bottom teeth fell out. So then Sam helped carve these ones. Okay, so not all of them. Yeah. Fell out. Yeah, but this one stayed in. Oh, good. It is tricky. Mm -hmm. So yeah, last week I had just taken three kids, Thomas, Kate, Lynn, and McKenna, to Asheville, and Madeline stayed home with the three little yeah. kids. So, yeah, but all the rest of the things I carved by myself. You did everything but a few of the teeth. Yeah, and I did carve the mouth. Great. Oh, here's the ducky. Oh, there's more. Ooh. They're coming along. Oh, that's fun. This has a cool pattern inside. Oh, wow, that's cool. It's really nice. From the strip <laughs> that's all spiky. Oh, oh yeah. Yes. I put out almost all the stuff with my hands and carved it almost all out, and then at the end I used the, the scraper. That's what that. I did too. Job. Three, except I haven't used that yet. Spin in the circle, and it out like we do. Yeah. They're gonna fling this out. You're gonna put it right here. They're gonna fling it out to the chickens. Come down here. Over the wall. It don't matter. Whee! And you just fucking do while you had it. Figure nerd. out the pumpkin insides and see. Custard. And all the chickens came running for it. And the ducks. So yummy. Spider. <laughs> Says, my name is Spider. Oh my gosh. Your voice is suddenly not a peep, but it's almost big. <laughs> oh, let's see here. So this is Andy's pumpkin. Oh yes. So the chickens will be pecking right here until it gets a hole. Or they're just gonna eat the insides out of it too. I wanted to video the chickens pecking it, but I ha they haven't caught it on video. So they just peck through all the way through and it looks like that they've carved it. So they still need to work on the smile a little bit. If they peck long enough, then it will carve a pumpkin. They've almost pecked this one completely through. They got one eye, the other eye, and smiles. Almost in. We are here helping someone stack some firewood. So he's splitting it. And we're gonna try to get this all stacked.
either. Kids are trying to stuff with one hand now. job. The girls are taking a break and looking at the chickens, of course. We finished stacking the wood. It took us about two and a half hours. Everybody pitched in and did really good. And then we're here at a park. We go to the bookmobile. The bookmobile comes to a spot. This little church through the woods over there, through the trail. A big blue bookmobile, that's really fun. And then we bring our scooter to the park and our picnic lunch. They're down there eating lunch right now. And I just riding around the scooters. And on the sunny day, it's really pretty. Like the mountains, those are the Blue Ridge Mountains right there, and that's the parkway on top. It's really fun, it's really pretty. You got all these fields of hay. There's the same, y'all, on a hoverboard. So it's fun. We've got a few more jobs lined up for the rest of the week. It's a busy working week. It's good for us. This is our favorite view by our house. So pretty. Happy Halloween! Today we've got a lot going on. I'm cooking some pumpkin. To make some pumpkin rolls, put the dough in my mixer here, and the boys are going out, <laughs> out to play in the woods. And I have a dinner and a pumpkin cooking in the oven. Ooh. Here it's sizzling. That's for our dinner, along with the pumpkin rolls. So that's been taken all morning to carve and cook the stuff to put in it. And then we've also been dehydrating some herbs. One year we got our first frost on Halloween night, and so I ran out to the garden and got all our herbs and dehydrated them all day. And so ever since, I just do it on Halloween, even if it's not... I don't, we don't see any sign of a frost anytime soon. What are you doing? I'm uh, having a baby doll picnic. A baby doll picnic? Yeah. That was fun. Mommy. What's that? Last time I used a stroller and it was like this. Really? And now it's like this. Oh no, you grew? Yeah. Oh, sad. Yeah, you're getting too big for it. Mm -hmm. This was my stroller. Yeah, it's so cute. You were such mm -hmm. a cute thing when you got that stroller. I'm gonna show outside. Is it nice day out there? Yeah. This is off our back deck. It's gorgeous. It's upper 70s. So nice. So no sign of any frost coming anytime soon. Which is great. The boys are out there playing in the woods somewhere. McKenna is reading. Mm -hmm. And her hair looks like a pumpkin. It's cool. It's a nice day outside. You want to go out? Okay. Let's see your hair again, Tilly. It is a candy corn. Mm -hmm. Did Maddie do her hair any fancy way? I don't think so. Uh, I don't think so. And Caitlin has a spider. Caitlin did her own hair as a spider. Like with eight legs. Yeah. Fun. So creative for Halloween today. Tilly's down there. 
Let's go see what she's doing. You having a picnic by yourself? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry I didn't play with you. Okay. Got the roll of dough done, but we can help shape the rolls soon. Okay. Are they all being good for you? Yeah. Oh, good. I recognize Bree with the pink hair. Uh -huh. What's this baby's name? This was Kylie's when she was a little girl. Yeah, this was Kylie's. Um, well, so, um, Andy named her Katie, but Kylie had a different name, but, but I don't know what it was. I'm trying to remember too. Got lots yeah. of dolls come and go with six yeah, girls in our family. Yeah, and then this one's Jenna. Jenna. Me and Jenna I used to usually play with, and then I started playing with bigger dolls, like the like ones that are my baby size. And I'm usually playing like with. Her yeah, those ones are size. more like a real baby size, huh? Yeah. They're kind of heavy. Uh -huh. Y'all enjoying your picnic? Uh -huh. Oh, good. And then this one's Tara. Hey, Tara. I like your black and white dress. Uh -huh. And then, yeah. And I got Tara from one of my, from Elf, Elf, one of the, one of my friends that were, was in it. She was, she was like, like do, you want, do you want me to give you something? And I wanted a needle, so she gave me her. Oh, that's so sweet. Like, when you were in the play Elf? Yeah. Elf. That was two years ago? Yeah. Fun, huh? That was nice of her to give you a doll. Fun little picnic. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go see what everyone else is doing. Okay. We are having our traditional dinner and a pumpkin that we eat every Halloween. I'm gonna make a video about it and put the recipe on my blog. Mm -hmm. You don't have to do it on Halloween, you could do it next week with any pumpkins you have on your porch. We eat it with some green beans and frozen cherries and my homemade pumpkin rolls. When you scoop out a little bit of pumpkin to eat, also as a vegetable, and put some salt and pepper on it. It's really good, thank you. You're welcome. We have had it every year since about 2003. Ooh. Then we're going to get our costumes on and go trick-or-treating. We are about to leave to go trick-or-treating. And we are all characters. We are all characters from Disney. Right? Yes. Okay. Y'all yes. guess who they are. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get in the car and go. All right. Happy Halloween. stops is the rescue squad. They have like a hot dog dinner which we don't need because we just ate but they also have candy and see some of our community here. This tiny little town. It's so cute. It's fun to um, trick or treat. So we've already been that spot and not much else. <laughs> but we'll show you a few houses that we go to. This is our favorite house. We're doing good, thanks. Good, good. This is a pretty house.
Gordon Man here. See, he lets us pick out any of his gourds. Some years he's got humongous ones. But ours didn't do good this year, so his probably didn't either. You like that one? Looks like a shell. <laughs> These are crazy. Where's she going, Austin? Crazy, crazy. Yay! Looks <laughs> like so he's got a tree down from the hurt. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. I like that bush. Ha ha ha. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Hello, Roger. Everybody can have two apiece. Oh, thanks. Okay. Is it fun? Yeah. yeah. It's getting dark, but. But this is what it's like trick or treating in the country. Counting out the candy and sorting it, trading. Well, that's the fun part of Halloween. Got some Easter candy for your Halloween candy. Fun part. Alrighty. Thanks for watching. See you next time.